2020 VW Golf GDI, Golf R versions powerful. The new Golf MK8 will also spawn a plug-in hybrid model, GDI, and Golf R, but the A Golf appears to have been shelved. Both of the Golf's performance-oriented forms, the GTI and Golf R, will get substantial increases in power for a total of 250 and 350 horsepower respectively. That will put the GTI on roughly equal footing with the Ford Focus ST and Subaru WRX, and the Golf R at the same level as the Ford Focus RS and closer to the Mercedes-AMG CLA45 and GLA45 models. The E-Golf, which VW had previously told us would arrive with a roughly 186-mile range, will disappear with the new generation according to Auto Express. The outlet reports that it's a casualty of VW's focus on the ID line, particularly the ID hatchback. That hatchback is due to arrive a year after the new Golf in 2020 for Europe, and VW says that it will deliver on the 373 mile maximum range, European cycle, quoted for the concept. In the US the first ID product we'll see is the production version of the ID Cross in 2020, followed by version of the ID Buzz van in 2022. Of course, it's also possible that the current generation e-golf might linger on for a year until the ID hatchback goes on sale. For more information on what's coming for the next generation VW Golf, be sure to check out our previous coverage on the hatchback.